At Oxford College of Business, we offer world-class business qualifications awarded by some of the best universities in the world. That's because all we do, all we are, is business education. Representatives of university students unions made a set of proposals to take into consideration regarding the South Asian Institute of Technology and Medicine in Malabe. They proposed to abolish site and private medical college and to pay compensation to students and for the government to take over the institute and to enroll students through a competitive examination. The president stated that the government will take measures to solve the issue after engaging in discussions with all relevant parties. After the hour-long discussion, representatives of students' unions addressed the media. We will like to tell the government to stand for the general public. They will have to regret if they stand for Neville Fernando. We did not get a proper answer during the discussion. Therefore, we will continue our battle. Minister of Higher Education and Highways Lakshman Kiriyalla also expressed views regarding the SITEM issue. If I say how fair the students of SITEM are, yesterday they told me that even though there is a court order in support of them, they are ready to sit for the examination of the Medical Council. We suggest the Medical Council to mediate and not be extremists. The Government Medical Officers Association threatened to resort to trade union action if government fails to give a solution to the SITEM issue. By next week, all the deans of the medical faculties, all the trade unions, political parties, civil organizations, university lecturers, students and all others will commence island-wide trade union action. Minister Rajita Senaradna, the only solution for this issue is to gasset the minimum standards of medical education.